the 3D printing worst nightmare, cracked glass. I have literally cracked my heat bed. Ah, uh, what am I going to do? No! So I thought about going to go ahead and buy a new one. However, I decided that I would cut my own. So let's go out and find a good, useful piece of glass for this. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and use this uh, fish tank as my glass. We can't cut tempered glass. This is just an indication that this is not tempered glass. See all these cracked arches like that? This is tempered glass, this whole pane should be shattered. So this is not tempered glass, so I'm gonna go ahead and use this other side. I'm gonna cut my bed out of this side here. So I'm gonna go ahead and disassemble it. All right, here's the sheet of glass that I have pulled out of the fish tank. So now I'm going to go ahead and cut the circle out of it, and then we'll score it. So the tools we need to do this is a simple glass cutter, and this is a circle glass cutter, so it sucks them down and actually cuts the glass. And then we also need a PVC pipe, and the reason why is we need actually this round edge on it. We're actually gonna use that to press it on the glass to break it at the spots we need it to break. Go ahead and set that to 30 centimeters, which is actually 300 millimeters. So the 300 millimeter radius bed, So there's the circle. So now we're just gonna go ahead and flip the glass over. It's the edge of this PVC pipe, this rounded edge. Just gonna go top. Just like that. And there's the circle. A sharp edge here so I'm just taking a sandpaper and I'm just going over the edge like that just to kind of make that edge not so sharp all right new ones in this ABS piece is into it and soften the outside edges which I then will push the two pieces together which should glue them together by melting the two plastics together so we just need a small bit in this bottom of the tray now as far as I understand acetone so, it's not going to kill you. So I'm just going to hold the pieces together for now. So they kind of... The connection's still a bit loose, but it hopefully will be enough to just let it leave there and let it... 